Hey, my cyber babies, thank you for joining us right here on our YouTube channel with the Mother Love Show. This gentleman is Sandro Manetti, my favorite new friend now because anybody talking about money is people we want to know about. <laughs> Why do you think, and I'm one of them and I'm guilty of this as an entrepreneur, I can go and ask for funding for somebody else. But it's like really difficult for me to come and say, well, Sandro, mm -hmm. here's my idea. How can I be of service? How can we collaborate? Because that's what it is that I'm doing. I, I, I rarely ask for the money. Mm. I rarely, rarely ask for the money. Well, you shouldn't be asking for the money. You should be talking about the opportunity. So I am doing the right thing. I'm, yes. I'm going about it yes. the right the way. Yes, the money, how oh. much it all costs should be the last thing. Okay. It's about presenting an idea. When you have a business idea, mm -hmm. if you want to attract investment, the key is to work out what problem it solves. Okay. And so if you've got a business idea that solves a problem, then you're very likely to find an investment. The other way is to find a business that doesn't really sort of exist but could generate a lot of cash. Examples, Uber, mm -hmm. Airbnb. Yes, it changed up the taxi industry, it changed up the accommodation mm -hmm. industry. Great. And to stick with the idea as, as, as well. And that's where I think a lot of, especially startup entrepreneurs, they fall down because it's not instant gratification. Mm. It's not like, oh, well, I got this brilliant idea and now I'm just going to go get my funding and like in two weeks I'm going to be like a multi billionaire and I'm not going to have to do any work. Talk to our audience about the importance of being in the trenches and doing the work. You've got the brilliant idea, you've got the money to invest in it, you can grow your business, and then they just figure like, well, I can just rest on my laurels. Well, actually, you can rest on your laurels. And the alternative funding forum is for those people as well, because what you're talking about is having an exit strategy. Oh. So you think you think of the business, you get all the investment, you make it a big, big success, okay. and then you sell it for an even larger amount of money. Oh. And you can either start another business, or come to next year's alternative funding forum and then get ideas <laughs> and, that way. You know, again. or you can retire to your yacht. You oh, know. See, retirement yeah. is nowhere in the script. But you for have me. to get educated, exactly. and the importance of events like this is they. Uh, we're all learning all the time, no matter how old we are, and we can always sort of learn learn more. And there's new types of funding. I mentioned before, um, you know, equity crowdfunding mm -hmm. is is new this year. And so you come to the alternative funding forum, and then you meet the experts, you meet all these sources. And so whether your desire is to just work hard for a short time and then retire or to hang on with a vice-like grip to this company and build it into the next <laughs> Facebook you, you could do that okay. but it's about telling you how so when you when you when you when you're sitting there I mean and you're getting all the, this information mm -hmm. I, one of the things I want the information about a little bit if you mm -hmm. can share with us is about the EB5 program mm -hmm. where we can now get foreign investment mm -hmm. and this is for the average everyday person mm -hmm. as well mm -hmm. we're sitting here in in Los Angeles mm -hmm. um, there's a construction boom in Los Angeles at the moment so many hotels going up down oh downtown and a lot of those are paid for with EB5 investment okay. and what that is is foreign money so um, this has started in the Clinton administration if you invest in American businesses and create a bunch of jobs you can get a green card in, ah. in return so that's what's in it in it for them okay um, and so uh, this is just one of the many alternative funding streams because people tend to think well you know will I get a loan from the bank or, or, or will I uh, just just uh, you know find some money money falling from, from the sky. Mm. There are government grants, there are places on, online, there are so many ways you can you can get funding. EB-5 is just, just one of many. This is so exciting. Tell them about how they can come to this forum and how they can get tickets and get 20% off when you tell them about Mother Love. Well, exactly. Yeah. Uh, if you go to <laughs> metropoleglobal.com, um, then you can book tickets there for our November 11 Alternative Funding Forum at the Skirball Centre, and it'll ask you for a code. Okay. And as Mother Love fans, you can put in the code RADIO20, that gives you 20% off. And, uh, you know, it's really worth the investment, because as I say, the best investment you can make is in yourself, it's and this can help you uh, connect with, with the money and with experts, and meet people like yourself who are doing the, the, the same thing. You're not alone Wait in this. There's so many. Thank you nothing. very much. Okay. Thank you. So many people trying to get the American dream. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm foaming at the mouth with excitement about the alternative funding forum. <laughs> but that's and that's a one. Hmm. If you got a foam at the mouth, that's all right. I, yeah. I wipe. I get the foam. Bit. Every time people mention investment money, I get excited. I get, get excited. excited. Yes. So, what are you going to do to top yourselves next year? 
Well, that's the wonderful thing about entrepreneurship. It's always changing. Always. You never know what the next funding stream is, what the next, the next business is. I mean, we have a lot of uh, uh, technological advancements. Uh, VR, virtual reality, is a big part mm. of this year's forum. It'll be something else next year. It's constantly changing. And you know what? I don't care what you all said. I made a virtual reality when I was 11 years old because I was not living in this world because it's crazy. I live in my own world. <laughs> listen to the people in my head and listen to Sandro Manetti. Thank you so much for sharing a pleasure your and information. <laughs> and babies, you know we love you and there's nothing you can do about this mother loving you. Peace, babies.